This project was developed by a very small team. We tried our best to be as unbiased as possible, but the results still remain only perspectives. In order to know more about the events here replicated, we highly recommend you to inform yourself personally as well. This is Riot, Civil Unrest. This is a game that pretty much says what it is on the tin. This is a game about riots. And I believe it's about controlling riots. So this is somewhat based on real life events, obviously. And it might be quite a based on real life events. Let's take a look. I should probably start the timer, huh? There we go. Riot, that is a cool game. Ah, you know the game. Does the volume sound good? Hey, let's just hop right in. I don't... Well, let's see. Global, story, versus. Oh, there's a versus mode? How's this work? And versus. Welcome to global mode. Choose your faction. Be prepared. Every action involves consequences. Your missions will become harder and harder without the public opinion in your favor. When the game becomes too difficult, try to play previous missions again with new strategies and new equipment. To try to prove the global public opinion. All right. I, I don't know. Should I play story or should I do rebels? Or wait, well, I see. You can be rebels or police. Um, let's do story. Yeah, let's do story for now. Uh, okay. No, no tav. I, I don't know. No tab. Okay. Vas Valsula, Vus Valsusa, Italy. Locals fight with all they've got against the corruption that lies beneath the construction of a 23 billion euro high speed train project. This does sound like a real life event. <clears throat> This is quite, this is quite the music, holy shit. Uh, difficulty. Too easy. Your modes are more resistant to fear. Fang durations reduce. All AI reacts very slowly. Uh, what are the other options? Challenging. Lawless. Let's just stay with too easy so I don't know how the hell we're playing. Alright, so, alright, so let's see here. Oh, we can choose which side we want to be on. Uh, let's be on the rider side because it sounds like they're fighting a Fighting bad things, so let's be on their side. Techno rock is a pretty sweet genre. Oh wow, look at that graphic! It's like photorealistic pixel art. The Italian government started building a NASA transportation system in the Susa Valley to speed up their the already existent transportation from Susa to the Lion. Okay. The project is expected to be concluded in 2035, and the estimated price is around 23 billion euros. That's a that sounds really expensive and long. Documents oh. I skipped, I skipped the dialogue, I think. Hold on. Let me try that again. I think it was scrolling automatically, but at the same time I pressed the button. Let me, let me go back through that. I want to read that. I guess I'll just... I guess I'll just chew, hold my jets and let it scroll. <laughs> Alright, let's see. So the TAV... Uh, high st oh, that's what TAV stands for. T-A-V. So TAV, probably. High Speed Train... I assume that's translated. No skipping. I don't want to. I want to read it. I want to read what's going on. So let's wait. I think it'll scroll on its own. Go ahead. Scroll on your own. Scroll. There you go. Okay. There you go. See. No, I can skip it. But then I. It, it's one of those situations where if the game is about to advance a text box and I advance it manually, I advance two text boxes essentially, which of course skips text. That's a bit. I I always find that annoying. I, I would. So I do wish games would be more clear about whether or not they're auto scrolling or not. Documents predict that before concluding the construction process, most of the forest will be cut down, and toxic chemicals will be released from the mountain drilling, polluting the whole region. Ah, so it's environmental calamity if this happens, more or less. Actually, one example comes from a, a, one example for a good cool, like timer, uh, the Modern Rogue on YouTube. Anytime they put up a fact on screen, there's a little circle that slowly empties. And it lets you know exactly how long that's going to be on screen. I love stuff like that. Um, activists have been pro protesting and fighting against the Tav project since 1992. I'm just going to call it Tav. It's probably Tav, but Tav, 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 whatever. It's okay, maybe you know what you're doing. I have no idea how to play this game yet. We will, f we will see. This is definitely intriguing me, though. All right, so crowd division diamond. Okay, so like a formation then, probably. Flags quantity some. Um. Several many. Few. 
Oh, thank you, Bill. What? Oh, hey, sorry, I was late. Greater than W, less than sorry to interrupt you, but keep on barking, B. <laughs> okay, Bill. Uh, I don't know, what, what are flags? I would think, like, flags would, like, be, a, like, a banner, but the more flags we have, the less people we have, so I'll just do some. Defensive gear, basic, defenseless. You get more people. You get more people if you're defenseless. If you're, like, armored up, you get more, you get less people. Okay, well, let's say basic. I have, what are these items? Oh. Malox typically reduces smoke grenade effect. Oh, wow, this is complex. Hold on, hold on a minute. Firecracker, very small explosive, calls a loud destination, use it to agitate opponents. Okay. Uh, Firecracker is many tied to flammable string, use it to make several loud detonations in a short time period. Malox typically reduces smoke grenade effects. Molotov, it's a bomb made of breakable glass bottles filled with petrol. The explosion scares off bonus. Yeah, probably could also burn them, but yeah, scares them. Uh, megaphone regroups rebels, boosting attention and discipline. Rocks, extra rocks, a backpack. Social calls additional help via social networks, and no item. So, this is a game about, about morale, from the looks of it. It seems to be your morale versus the enemy's morale, um, which is interesting. I mean, let's bring some uh, firecrackers, why not? But do we get less people participating if I do that? Let's see. Slightly, but not very no, too less. Seems worth it. The game is really cool and complex. You can try to go as civil as possible, making people on your side or violent, make a public anger. All right, let's actually let's try. That's a good point. Um, let's see what what would be the most what would be the most uh, friendly way of doing it. Well, we got the megaphone, which is, that's probably fine. I, we don't want rocks. Social would be good. Uh, the reducing smoke grenade effects is probably fine. I mean, firecrackers don't actually hurt anybody, so let's. Uh, yeah, now, let's not bring those though. Let's let's just keep it chill. At least I don't think firecrackers hurt people. Maybe firecrackers hurt people. I guess they could. All right, let's get let's give it a shot. Available time four point five. Don't know what that means. Tactical units in Testudo formation are hard to move away, but they can easily be harmed with Molotov cocktails more easily than other units. Ah, okay. So Testudo formation being the really clustered one we see on the right. So it's like hard to move away, but more vulnerable to splash damage. Gotcha. Well, the other thing that reduces the effects of smoke grenades, that's a defensive thing. That doesn't sound too bad either. This is an interesting, huh, interesting way to do cutscenes. Oh, this is really kind of neat. Escorting the construction equipment. Oh. I wasn't expecting this much production value. It's actually quite cool. Right. I'll protect all tents from being destroyed. Uh, sure. How, how do I play? I realize that this is not a tutorial now. Um, let's see. Well, I have a cursor, and I can move them by pushing the cursor. And I have abilities. I can select hands. There's hands on the right. There's hands on the left. I can select three of them. Uh, I can select all of them by pressing a direction. All right. I can select my items with D-pad. All right. Uh, should I just call help? Or what do I do here? Oh, I see. I can move the different groups by... I gotcha, I gotcha. I understand. There's four groups here. Okay, I guess I should push them, right? We don't want the tents destroyed. That would not be... Oh, he destroyed a tent. Well, trial by fire. This is what this will be. Alright, well, our groups are getting stuck on each other, so that's not terribly helpful. Form a defensive barrier for the tents, I guess? Right. Uh, I think I, I got my group stuck on each other. That's fine. Push, push. That, that group has broken through. It's good, I guess. It's a little hard to tell who I'm selecting. You need to block the police. There's a timer on top. I mean, I am blocking them, right? Except for I got my group stuck on each other, which I didn't know I could do, but apparently it's a little hard to tell who my groups are. Right then, the hard way it is. 
the stimulants are kicking in. Stimulants? I will push them. Everybody get in. Everybody push. Push. It's like football. Uh, let's see. How do I call... Oh, that's how. Okay. Got some support. Siblings are wearing off. Morale is going down. What, do we get everybody drugs to for this? I mean, maybe. Police have different tools, too. Okay. I mean, right now, I'm just pushing. So this is just a defense mission. Police must destroy objective in two minutes. So as long as we don't let them do that, I guess we'll win. I have to say, it's a little chaotic, but I guess that's what a riot is, really. Let's see. Let's use a megaphone. What is, I think it's like too easy, because what the hell? I think it's actually simpler than it looks. What does X do? There's a button on it. Oh. Well, let's do that with everybody. So what, does that, what does that accomplish? It's made every, I made every group cheer. They also have flags. What do flags do? I'm not sure. I'm not sure what flag does. Oh, each group can call a different social network, I just realized. All right, get overwhelm them with numbers. Provoking. Apparently, I'm provoking. Whoops. I'm not provoking now. So this is like an aggression meter. I gotta worry about. Okay. It's uh. I would say it's kind of hard to remember which button selects which group. Okay. Are you sure you're provoking out that we actually it was on the right side of the screen, so it probably was the police. Because I was not. Oh yeah, so. Okay. Newspaper. Let's see. True fact news: protesters peacefully resist against police attack. Italy this afternoon, 1431, and police, three policemen were unable to evict the 300 protesters. The occupied area, some mild clashes occurred, but nobody was severely injured or the event. Okay. I've unlocked December 8th. Good, I unlocked time moving forward. Indignado, in, Indignados campaign. That was a really cool intro to that. Does every level get a cool intro? I hope so. Uh, or maybe just each campaign. All right, well, um, yeah, you're right. I guess I didn't really need the firecrackers. I'm just gonna leave the settings to whatever they default as for now. I guess that's fine. Um, I mean, that seemed pretty good the way I did it. Let's get that megaphone up in here though. Those are useful. I mean, that lose, you, know, you lose 10 people getting the megaphone, but it calls more than 10 people. So what's the, what's the harm? All right, let's keep going. I mean, I guess just pushing them works pretty well if I don't want to be aggressive. It was very easy. It was pretty, pretty easy to get my group stuck on each other, though, so I very care be careful about that. Okay, so we are getting cutscenes for each level. That's really cool, actually. These are really well done. I like these.
What's the objective here, then? I also like how it sags into gameplay. Get inside the construction cap. Okay. Well, I guess getting my groups tangled up also made... Well, I got inside the construction cap. So <laughs> They don't seem to care much, do they? Like, oh, I guess they're in the construction cap. Well, all right. Also, I see no harm in immediately just using the megaphone straight out. Get more people on my side. Well, that was not hard. I'm not even... I'm still passive, too, so whatever. Let's just push in. Well, that was easy. <laughs> All right. That was effectively a Zerg rush. Because there required no skill, it was an immediate quick attack. Peaceful protesters move across 40 police. Protesters managed to pass through a police block of 40 units this morning around 11 o'clock. Some mild clashes occurred, but no one was severely injured during the event. Yes. I unlocked a lot. I unlocked Maddie at Burdella. Harmless kid that randomly creates chaos and violence around him. What? That doesn't sound very harmless at all. To be fair, I am I have some pretty easy settings on this, because I you know this is new, so I don't really know if I if I could handle this well. So I'm just, you know. Oh, a lot of a lot of a lot of aggressive things here. Let's remove those. Uh, Moloch's does sound useful thing to use gas. If I use a smoke grenade, I should do- I should use that. What's this? Don't give me the event, but take a specific picture of fluids the media's result. Okay, that sounds useful. Oh, let's take social, actually. There we go. Excellent. You use swift and it never misses. <laughs> exactly. So this is all the same campaign, right? We're still, we're, this is all to basically try to stop the uh, train being built. So this is going to destroy a lot of things and pollute a lot of things. What's the objective here? Complete the objective. What is the objective? Occupy. So stay on the highway. Got it. All right. Well, again, immediately, I don't see any reason not to immediately call social. And probably the other things, too. Take pictures. Just, just do everything. Oh, wow. What's something happened? Are we getting pushed? We might be getting pushed. That's all right. Ah, smoke grenade. Uh, let's reduce the effects. Reduce the effects. All right, gather, gather. I will occupy. Where do I need to occupy exactly? I guess just here. All right. Making sure I use all my abilities as soon as they unlock, basically. Especially social, since that gets me more people. I think I'm doing okay. I'm just like going nuts through these abilities since they seem to refresh pretty quick. Get all the pictures. What if timing it with a smoke bomb would be useful? Oh, here we go. Let's uh, use that. I think when that sound happens, that means there's going to be smoke soon. Alright, I reduce the effects though, so it's alright.
I'm kind of losing ground, though, so let's push. They're being really violent. We're being completely passive, though, so, you know. Keep calling those, just keep calling the hot bars. There we go. Just keep using those. Nope, nope. Where are you guys going? Alright, do I need to use any more uh, Malox here? Let's see. Yes, I do. Don't know what exactly is going on, but I'll keep going. Am I doing fine? I think I'm doing fine. A little hard to tell. Riots are very well chaotic. I'm just really, I'm just cycling through these hop bars because that seems to be the most useful thing I can do. I think we're doing okay. Watch out! I'm constantly holding right so that hopefully. Oh, okay. Did I, did I overwhelm the game with some? Oh, whoop. Game? Okay. Welcome back, Gabe. I think I'm doing okay. The stream is dying for me. Oh, don't say that. I might be... Am I really... Is this intensive? Hold on a minute. Try and look down. They killed someone. They're killing people. That's not good. They break through. I, I don't know what exactly I'm trying to do, but also I'll check the frame. I'll check the frames after this. After this, whatever we're doing. Like, is it okay for me to break through them, or do I need to prevent them from breaking through me? I don't really understand. My stream is holding up fine. That's good. There was a big lag spike, but that was the game, not the stream. The game just, like, completely froze on me for a bit. Oh, wow, they're using water now? They're being fucking mean, dude. They didn't like my Zerg rush from last level. I pissed them off. I don't know, my group's really split up, but I mean, some of my group's in front, so I think that's fine, right? As long as I keep up the pressure. There we go. You need to drag people back to the left side. Oh, you do? I thought being frontal was fine. Oh, well, whatever. I, I do not understand what's going on, but I think at the same point that makes a lot of sense, because Riot. <laughs> Uh, so 11 casualties if police fails to evict punks. 90 policemen were unable to evict the 400 predecessor for the occupied era. The bloodbath caused 11 victims plus 267 total injured. Wow, in 16 minutes. That's a lot of fucking injuries in 16 minutes. The situation got way out of control as the 11 deaths will cause chaos confusion to the entire country. Well, we didn't fight back, so... We stayed passive. The beginning of the end. Okay. We got an M6. The game really wants me to go violent. It just gave me a fucking automatic gun. All right. Well, you know. Game, it's fine. I don't... I'm not interested in doing that. <laughs> yeah, this game's a bit intensive, so that explains the leg, leg spike. Uh, let's take a quick look. Quick hot take. Hot take for a second. One moment, please. We did not drop frames, though, so that leg was entirely just the game. Um, all right. The game is a bomb. The game really wants us to go violet. <laughs> oh, wait, it's just it's a paper bomb. Actually, is that does it count? 
I wonder if it counts as going violent to use like that sort of thing. Actually, that does sound dangerous though, because it has plaster in it, which is probably hard enough to cause damage. Let's uh, let's just stick to what I've been doing though. I mean, is scaring the opponent with something that doesn't hurt them bad? Or like, mean? That's what I'm curious about. Do it, make the pre protest violet. Not right now. Maybe the next, maybe the next campaign. This is like a campaign, so. Probably because sometimes people protesters aren't an option. Well, they kill a lot of people, so at this point it's really justified. Well, they killed people in general, which is pretty unjustified considering that it was a peaceful protest I was doing. Still though, <clears throat> we're gonna say peace all the way with this one, just because I'm kind of curious how that'll work. The guy is shooting the water had stormtrooper aim. He kept hitting his own man. Did he? I was I was there's so much going on I couldn't really pay attention to the water was going. That's pretty amusing though. Maybe it was a double agent. The only way M16 isn't violent is if you shoot it straight up the air to scare people. All right, let's uh, let's get set. Let's immediately just start with like social, just social stuff. Rebels must destroy objective. Oh, okay, push, push, push. Don't worry about the uh, violence. It's fine. What's our objective? What are we trying to destroy? You bet I'll destroy it, though. Generators. Oh, okay. All right, get that generator. There we go. I think we're doing something to it. Oh, that, oh, that is, it, is it done? Okay, it's done. Let's go. Everybody out, everybody down this one. Here we go, everybody, every this way. There we go. Would you guys stop? Okay, I know. Malox, Malox, go. <clears throat> Basically, if they shoot a smoke grenade and I don't have Malox going, everybody runs kind of weirdly. Oh, that's already gone, okay. That's just the one outside, the easy one. Go. There we go, okay. I think the idea here is that it's supposed to be overwhelming and hard to like control everything, but I'm just focusing on my hotbar. Which seems to be working quite well. Get into that get into that smoke and dill the uh I need to get people outside. No yeah, run out, run out. I need to get them outside the walls, because they're really hard to navigate actually. Now come back here. Don't run all the way. Hoard it. There we go. It's hard to move an entire crowd of people when there's walls. Get in there. Attack. Attack. Trying to get them to attack. There we go. There we go. Okay. <clears throat> Shadow, I have no idea what you're going on about because your English is weird. I'm sorry. No, no offense to non English speakers, but I really don't know what you're talking about. I don't know why my friend is blocked from one server in Discord. Because probably because he's not allowed on that server. There's we have we have private servers, but um Okay, whatever. Uh, true fact news. Acts of vandalism in Italy. Despite the resistance of 20 police officers, several acts of property damage were caused by murders in Italy. 
Even though a few were injured, it appears that most managed to go back home without being severely harmed. No muas. Okay. Notre Dame de la Mondays. Paper bomb. Rockets. DUI smoke. Okay, that. Hey, if we counter with smoke grenades, is that aggressive? Well, they were being aggressive when they used smokes on us. Colored eggs makes the target who gets hit unusable. The uh, colored eggs. What? What the hell is a colored egg? I don't have no. I have no idea what that is. Somebody explain. Unlocked 44 because of the power of his fist. They used to call this Doctor 44. Journalist mode. Okay. Global mode. I thought I already had global mode. Nearly everything is aggressive. That's what I thought. So I think this game is having, I think this game might have a memory leak issue. Cause each time a level loads, it takes a little longer than the last level. A tie-dyed egg. I mean, probably, I'm just wondering, it's probably an actual like item that exists in real life, but I don't, I've never heard of it before. I really like the production value of the cutscenes. Oh, so each ride is also framed like a complete story with its own credits. That's gonna be. I'm golf. That was a little slow, but thank you. <laughs> the grant that I didn't ask anybody to update the game. Start sounds pretty neat. It is. Now we should start a civil war. I, I, let's not. Also, how, hey Kiyoshi, how you been lately? Police are wearing penguin helmets. helmets. Or penguin hats. That would strike tr true fear into a rider if, if the police looked like a penguin. Lord? I see. Hmm. August Giondo Osbaum. That's a really odd O. Wow, there's a lot of people that back this game. I'm kind of just sitting on this because the music's actually really cool. Alright. Shadow, if this is about Razor, Razor is actually been... He's been a bit of a nuisance. And been pushing me for conversation and stuff that, where I don't want it. So, uh... I, I, I'm ignoring him for that reason. If that's, if that's what your whole conversation earlier was about, that's the answer. He wants to come to the streams, hang out, that's cool. But he's a cool as Jets. Also, let's drop the topic, okay? If you do stick around. I think, uh, I think it's gone on long enough. Except with what Razor... I, I'm not interested in private one-on-one -on -one conversations with Razor. So he needs to stop trying to create private one-on-one -on -one conversations on my DMs, on FA, etc. Um... He needs to chill out, just come to streams, or hang out on the group, or hang out on the group server. Well, I wasn't planning on bringing this to this chat, which, it's fine. Simply a guy that's been bothering me a lot, and, uh, I've tried to let him know not to- Wow, there's a lot of backers. I'm kind of wondering how many backers there are at this point. I like how- oh, just randomly one Japanese name. <laughs> so, uh, who here has actually heard of this game? 
And a very special likes to every single person who believes the project of Lavaria and dedicated to those who gave their life to change the world. This game seems to be a passion project. And also, it's really cool. Uh, like, it seems... Oh, it's a shame that I tried to loop the music. Uh, riot Editor. That's kind of neat. Steam Workshop. So you can also make your own riots. Well, so that was the... That was the Notov story. I guess that's one of four stories that are available. Um, I'm kind of... I technically should probably put the difficulty to, like, challenging. But at the same time, I'm really bad at these sorts of games, so I kind of don't want to. Um. Hmm. Versus could be very interesting. I just can't. I still don't see my. I see myself get, I, like even on easy mode. I found myself getting very overwhelmed. I'm kind of curious. What? How does global mode work though? Missions get harder and harder. It says. So does it choose randomly? Okay. So these are like single missions then. Let's try one of these. Madalena's clearing. That Valsus, uh, Italy, local fight gets. Uh, wait, no, this is the uh, this is the same thing. So it's, it's actually the same as the story mode missions. I thought they might be their own unique missions, so I was taking a look. Ah, uh, clear lock pale, you know. So it looks like we unlock like particular protesters or such when we, or probably police as well. We should probably play the police side in something. Um. Except for, in this case, every in every example here, the police are not the good guys, I realize. these In every single one of these examples, the police are the bad guys. Because <laughs> um, look, a small group of activists in Spain are able to expand, change their nation's politics, and influence the world through a peaceful movement known as the Indignados. Peaceful. Inhabitants of a small town in Greece, Karatea, uh, unite to stop the construction of a legal junkyard that's being built very close to their homes. Uh, people from all Egypt gather in Tahrir, Tahrir Square to protest against the crime and violence behind the regime of Hosni uh, Mubarak. So, yeah, the police are bad at every situation. <laughs> That's I actually find that a bit of a shame. There have been situations, after all, where the police were on the right in a riot situation, you know? So it could have been nice, it would have been nice to maybe have a spread of bowl. But I guess this game's focus is, uh, productive riots, I suppose. Granted, it's giving me violent tools for some of these riots, so I don't know. It's kind of odd. Uh, there, and, and honestly, when it comes to riots in real in real life, there are times where one side is right, and there's times where the other side is right. It's dynamic. I find that sometimes a riot, a peaceful protest, uh, people peaceful protest is not exactly a riot, but uh, even on the no tov though, we were like destruction of property and stuff. You know, the generators. It's like, I understand their position, but that even that's technically... It actually, that was kind of weird. When we were destroying the generators and the Notov, that was still peaceful. I wouldn't call that peaceful. That's destruction of property. That's not very peaceful. Occup occupation of a location and refusing to move from it, thats that can still be peaceful. But destruction of property is technically violent. The game makes both parties step over the border. Yeah, I can see that. There are definitely times where neither side is right. That's absolutely true of a lot of riots. Actually, that's an awful lot of riots. Um, let's go to let's go to here. Friday of anger. We could be the police. I don't really don't be the police though, because all the police here are jerks. Uh, all right. Let's just be the protesters again. I, honestly, I'm here for the cutscenes. These are really cool. Oh, shit. Yeah, exactly why I don't want to be the police. That right there. <laughs> In Egypt, the unemployment rate is high and poverty is increasing every day. Yeah, that guy absolutely deserved to be shot. Look at him, like, raise his arms. That's such an aggressive action. Wow. <sighs> Again, these are based on real-life events, so I wouldn't be surprised if these cutscenes are demonstrating something that actually happened. 
After living for 30 years in a state of emergency, millions of protesters demand the overthrow of President Hazi Mubarak's um, Egyptian regime. So it's either be a bad guy or a villain. I mean, at times that's what that's kind of what you have. Like again, some ri some riots, not either side's right. So, well, riots are usually not a good thing. But there, I mean, again, there's a difference between a riot and a protest. So even though it says like rioters set up, technically we're we're being protesters. At least the way I'm playing, we're being protesters, not rioters. Uh, well, granted, except for we had to destroy the generators. That was a forced objective, so. I guess we were rioters on the last mission. The other missions, we were just pushing and occupying, which is not technically rioting. I mean, yeah, it's it, it's it's it might be a misdemeanor to occupy air ter territory you're not allowed to be in, but it's not actually violent unless you're doing something violent there. Uh, but yeah. Thanks, Spiris. This might be a coup. Can we do a, p a peaceful coup? Doesn't sound very possible. We will see what happens. This sounds like it's going to immediately start violent. Give that cutscene. Yeah, well, that kind of demonstrates that. Who is a military revolt? Oh, okay, fair enough. I don't know build I don't know terms very well. Uh, complete the objective. What's the objective? Save all students from something. What? What are we doing? Rebels must hold position. Okay. Push them. That's my usual that's my motif for this stuff, so you know. I just need to make sure I... Wait, police must hold position. What? I'm sorry, what position are we trying to not hold or hold? Oh, we're trying to go back there? Oh, shit. Okay, go, go, go. We are just trying to go right, I think. I assume we're, we need to go get the... I think we have to get the students? Well, actually, I actually don't really know what we're doing. Just push. Just, we're just going to push. That seems to be something important. Seem to be almost to the dot, so that's good. What exactly are the place holding? That's what I'm not sure about. I mean, I think I messed this up. I think we're about to lose. Yeah, so stay in one place? Oh, is that what we're supposed to do? I like to push! <laughs> My attitude is, holding position is not as good as gaining position. But apparently not in this time. Alright, stay in one place, got it. Let's try it again. What's, uh, I do wish the game was a little more clear what area I need to be in. I think it does flash really fast at the beginning, basically the zone it wants me to be in. But there's no way for it to, maybe there's a way to tell, to... Maybe there's a button I can press to have it tell me a second time, but I don't know where that button is. So, in other words, I wish it was a little more clear. I think, yeah, see, there's a circle here, so I guess stay here. Okay. No, no, stop pushing, stop, no. I don't want you to push, I just want you to... There we go, that group. Get up, get up, no, stay in the, stay in the circle. There you go. Alright, you know, just everybody just kind of, I don't know. Call new people and stuff. It's fine. It's a little hard to control a group like this. No, guys, no, stop. I'm not even telling them to push. Now they're just doing it on their own. I have I have taught the AI at this point to push, so now they're just doing it automatically. <laughs> Again, they're just doing it automatically. Stop. 
Use the megaphone keeps everybody clustered, by the way. Fake. Megaphone regroups. That's nope, nope. Don't go regroup there. Regroup there. It's hard to tell them. It's hard to figure out where they're going to actually regroup, though. Okay, now we're both pushing and holding. That works, I guess. As long as I keep just hitting the Wi-Fi signal, I'll constantly get more people. Which is very useful. Good thing they didn't... If they, man, if the police just dropped... If just if the police just killed the internet of the area, that would probably really mess up my uh, ability to recruit. <laughs> that's, that's what they should be doing. They should just turn off the internet. Just turn off all Wi-Fi signals. Man, you have to hold position for quite a while. It's not to push people now, they just see a cop start out pushing. I mean, it's kind of good. It's kind of good they do that. Depends on how it's used, though. Man, I... Even though this is a pixel game, having this many entities on screen is actually, like, kind of intensive for the computer, I think. <laughs> to be fair, this is a fuck ton of people. Alright, let's stay in the circle, guys. Come on. Social refresh is a lot slower than everything else, but that's fine. I don't run too far away. I just want you to back up a little bit, guys. Jeez. Megaphone can be used all the time, though. Also, this just seems to be the game of cycle through the hotbars and make sure to keep using useful things. That seems to be how I'm playing it, at least. I don't have a lot of time to focus on the screen. I'm just looking at the hotbar buttons. Like, is this on cooldown? Is this on cooldown? Nope. Okay, cool. I mean, it seems to be working. There need to be a few people for right. Yes, absolutely. I'm not blaming the game for having too many people or something. That makes perfect sense. The game needs more people on screen. Okay, fair enough. I'm just gonna sit back. I've already won this. Ten seconds. I need a drink of water. Just look at them. Just do, I'm not doing anything now. They're just pushing. Some people brought peace flakes, so I'm glad I did that peacefully, because otherwise their peace flakes would make a lot of sense. Wait, there's more... Yeah, uh, look, I, had, I got nearly a thousand people. What did I start with? Like, 150? <laughs> Prior to this peacefully resist against police attack. This is after you did 629. 629, the 130 policemen were unable to evict the 900 protesters. Somebody had flashed the I was severely injured. Fright of Anger, Part 1. Oh my. <laughs> What's this? What is, what is this? Oh, DUI smoke. That's, you know, we, uh, we don't need that stuff. You know, I play one way and it works. So, you know, I keep doing it that way. Oh, you know, I could just have 5 million megaphones if I, oh, you know what? I'm going to try, I'm going to try something. I'm going to try something a little bit. This could be, this could be really stupid. Let's see what happens. Everybody. Bring two, four, everybody make sure to bring an ex, like an extra three cell phones. We're going to call everybody. Let, you want more people? I'm going to crash my computer. I gotta say, the music's really good too. Like, music and cutscenes, solid. Gameplay, a little confusing for my brain, but hey. <laughs> yes, exactly, Beerus. Oh no. At least we know what happened. What, what happened to the stream dies? It's called Too Many, too many Riders. Alright, what are we doing? Move the process across the bridge. Sure can! Let's call all my friends about it first. Oh, can I only use one thing at a time? Oh. 
Oh, I'm disappointed. I don't think I can actually select the other ones. I think the I think while I can select multiple, I don't think I can actually use the others. It doesn't let it doesn't seem to be letting me. Oh, that's very disappointing. Well, I guess we're handicapped then. Whatever. Push, 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 push everyone. Why are they not going? I'm, I'm I actually can't push them now. They're, they're not. They're not go. 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 Oh, is there a barricade? Was there a barricade? The barricade is gone. Oh, I see. There was, like, stuff in my way. Let's right, just go. Let's go. Zerg rush. Zerg rush. That's disappointing. Why does it let me select uh, multiples of the same thing if it doesn't actually work that way? And actually, I think I broke something because now I can't select anything. Like, it, it, technically I have up selected, but I can't use it. There, I finally got to use it. There's something buggy going on here. <laughs> There we go. Right, at least I used it now. Some people are being very... I guess the megaphone is actually very useful for getting them to move. It does say it regroups them, so I'm thinking that's probably why some of them aren't moving. Uh, what was I... No, hey, what was that? something get thrown? What was that? I think I have a group praying for some reason now. That's that's good. I hope that helps her morale. What are they shooting? I guess most. I guess smoke, but whatever. They're shooting smoke where I'm not at yet right now, so it's fine. Theoretically, though, actually, who am I supposed to be pushing right now? Because it looks like I'm doing fine, but I'm not. So I'm not really sure what I'm doing. Can I make these guys stand up now? Oh, that's... We won't meet violence and violence. We are your brother and sister. Yeah, I'm, like, doing some sort of, like, peaceful outs crying with, the, with this group. I don't know what that accomplishes exactly. They're all sitting down and basically showing that they're not going to hurt... I think that's not very helpful for this mission, though, unfortunately. I'm, I'm not sure... Can, can we move, guys? Can we just move? I'd love to... How do we... What's this button do? I have to hold down Y. What does this accomplish? I'm not sure. I can't get that group to stand up. So they're just gonna sit... Th they're literally just sitting on their asses for now. I'm trying to get them to switch. When I hit that button, so I switched them off a of flag, and now this is just what they do. Huh. I changed the mode of the group, change it again. Yeah, I'm trying to figure out how you do that. When you hit when you hit B, it switches it to it switches it to that, and then they don't ever get up again. This seems to be my problem. Let's, re let's, uh, let's uh, restart. Can I restart by at the select screen, or do I restart the mission? Okay, good. Well, first off, since I, I've really... Okay, game developers, if I can't use four social uh, uh, inventory items, then don't let me select four social inventory items. Just little FYI there. Um, it's kind of dumb, you know. Uh, let's try that again. It does, the flag, when I select the flag item is, icon, it changes to the city icon. If I select the city icon, it stays on the city icon. I don't understand how to change it again. The police are just high in their car. It worked. It worked. Maybe the four items stacked in effect? I don't think they did. So I wasn't getting that many people from it. All right, let's try this again with the... Yeah, the megaphone is what gets people moving. The megaphone is like essential. At least for my limited knowledge of how to play, it's essential. Problem is, there's just, okay there, I think I got some people, I don't know, what's going on? 
Oh, I guess I, I did it. Okay. I couldn't tell if I was succeeding or not, but I guess that was it. Well, look at this mass. Look at this mass right here. Alright. Megaphone makes a huge fucking difference, if you hadn't noticed. Police were under control, riders were people. Everybody was chilled today. Move across under police. Yep, okay. You're getting spray of water. It's fine. I'm fine. Also, I should probably... I don't understand. Maybe I should mess with this. What do you think flags do? Having less of them means more people. You know what? I want all the people. So let's just... There we go. Basically, I basically cannot play without the megaphone. This is a true statement. It seems to be more or less a required item for my play style slash level of experience. Flags help guide people. Ah, uh, okay. Let's get a few more then in that case. That would make sense. Just the amount of responsiveness. Oh. Are we... I thought... No cutscene? Okay. No cutscene this time. I hear guns. Wait, didn't we already... Wait, wait, hold on. Did I just play this, or... I'm confused. Did I just... Did I somehow select the same mission twice? What did I do? Was this my fault? Whatever, let's just win it immediately. Strange indeed. I'll, I'll check on this in a second. Speed run! No, you, you can't do that. Power of megaphones is more powerful than water. There. Alright, so I'm gonna hit next. Okay. I didn't lock that before. The game seems slightly glitchy. You notice that? Oh god, water! Holy shit! Water! It's, it's not over! The mission's not over! He's still he can fucking attack. Alright, so here we are. We're back. Now we're- now things are back to normal, I guess. Uh, that was weird. That was very weird. I wonder what- oh, laser pins. Powerful laser light used to slow down the opponent. Okay. Bits of gear? Nah. Flags? Let's get a few. I also like, can never select my crowd division on a hostility. That's odd. Um, so what am I doing? Resisting? Oh, I'm trying to resist. Resist by pushing. It's fine. No man can be actively nonviolent and not rise against social justice no matter where it occurred. No man can be actively nonviolent and not rise against social justice no matter where it occurred. Is that true? Sorry, I like. I wonder. Oh, Gandhi said that. Well, if Gandhi said it, I guess it is true. <laughs> Shrug. Oh, if, God, if Gandhi said it, I guess his definition of nonviolent is different than mine. Um, because Gandhi certainly was not very violent, but he, huh? It's just a quote. I need to. I need to know more context around that one. Oh, satellite. I understand, Shadow. Just uh, yeah. Just need to chill. On January 28th, the government shuts down all internet and cell phones. Can be oh no, I have no, no, that's not good. I need that diplomatic car. Oh shit! A lot of violence in this one. Like a lot of violence in this one. Okay, you shot him with a fucking shotgun. Do you need to beat him up? You can't, you can't be peaceful without standing up against injustice, is what it said. Now, have you ever seen Gaudi in any Civ game? Yeah, I know what you mean. Kick all the police out of their curbs. I can do this. Push pa pitch tactics, go. We, we have seen the power of push tactics.
He's dead, kill him more. Like, why the fuck would you do that? You've already shot him in the chest. He's no longer any threat to you whatsoever. Tolerating violence means you are not peaceful. Oh, that's what that means. Okay, I didn't really understand the structure of the statement, basically. But, yeah, okay, that makes more sense. Tolerating violence does mean you're not peaceful. That makes sense. I agree with that. If you see something happening, you could do something about it. You don't do something about it. That's not cool. I will generally fight with words, but I will fight if I need to. I like how they shut down the they shut down the internet, but I'm still calling people using social networks. It's fine. I, I have we hacked our own Wi-Fi. It's fine. That's how that's how you can do that. You just hack you in your own Wi-Fi. There, that's how the internet works. They just shot one of your guys. Oh god, yeah, this explains the blood. Again, I'm mostly busy looking at the hot bar. But that, that actually, that absolutely just happened. Alright, I'm just gonna have to push them harder then. Oh, I pushed too hard with that group. Alright. Okay, that group? No, everybody regroup. Get over there. Can I, can I push them? I hope I can. They're pretty resistant to pushing, I have to be honest. I feel like I don't have enough people to create a mass and push them. I mean, I can get more people. Oh, fuck. Okay, that won't help me get more people. Not if people die. This group kind of deserves a grenade to the face, actually. I kind of have to agree with... Kind of have to agree with the idea of, like, actually fighting back. Oh, they're... Are they literally just throwing grenades? What are they doing? They're not using smoke grenades. I think I actually need to be violent in this one. Because I'm not being able to do much to these guys. Actually, I wonder, can I? Can I use fisticuffs them? Probably not, they're in right here. Actually, I could turn their hand signals different colors. Okay, stop right away, guys. Come on. I mean, I know people are getting shot in the chest, and we don't have weapons, but stop right away, guys. Come on. All right. Yeah, passive didn't really work too well here. They're still managing to hold the position, so... Well, I know I don't need the smoke stuff for this level. They were nearly out at one point? Oh, actually, that explains why the timer changed. But maybe it is possible. Maybe it is possible. Okay. I mean, that group's pushed away. Actually, if the other group just keeps pushing, they're going to get out of the position, so... Okay, can we, like... Guys, come on. Push, the, push those assholes. Timer keeps changing, and I don't know why. Payback? We're in payback mode now. What does that mean? I mean, I don't... Look. Maybe it's time you... I honestly actually am not against... Like, fisticuffs if it comes to it. I just want to kill people. Can I tell my guys to punch everybody? I mean, they're in riot gear, but we have a lot of guys. They've had enough of the cop shit. This is fair. I mean, look at all the shit going on. Hey, okay, there are lots of smoke grenades. Let me just. Hold 
all the well, we could also wait. We're actually breaking through. I think I think we I think they lost their nerve. That's right. There we are dealing with morale here. We're not just trying to beat them up. So actually, this is kind of working. There we go. They have gone violent after the police have gone violent. See, that's a fair situation. Police are forced out of a riot. Police committed some mild, mild acts of violence. People got shotgun to the chest. Rioters were peaceful, though. I think payback is completely unreasonable. It was reasonable situation. <laughs> After 15 injuries and 16... Only 15? People question whether or not this kind of violent that came out was necessary. We at, we attacked, but we really just attacked by basically not backing down. We made them run away because we wouldn't run away ourselves. Uh, that's kind of how I prefer to do it. They were wounded, not killed. Well, it looked very painful, so I kind of thought they died. But fair enough. I'm glad they didn't die, I guess. All right, battle of the camel. We must still back our cigarette brand. In order to carry a positive action, we must develop here a positive vision. Camels, wait, literally camels. How are cabals involved? Beanbag slugs? Well, there's a lot of blood. That's why I thought they died. But that's good, I guess? But it looked fucking... I don't know. Let the, don't let the cabals attack the protest. Wait, cabals? Wait, is this a real event? Also, why? I, I guess... I mean, what? We guys hold the position? Okay. Where, where the fuck are we? All right. Why is everybody on the north? Okay, whatever. I mean, camels are... Aren't camels kind of mean? I don't think I want to get attacked by camels. Also, I'm not sure, again, not really sure where I'm defending. I assume the camps. I mean, the camels are just kind of... Do they have swords? I feel like the camel users are holding swords. But what is going on here? <laughs> We're just at a standstill now, okay. This is fine if we just want to hang out. Kind of pushing us, actually. Let's just try to stop that. I mean, we're in the giant green circle, so it's fine, right? Ah, oh, there we go. Some more people. Excellent. The cabals will spit on you. That is our worst attack. I'm very unsure about the bar at the top of the street. I don't think it quite is telling me what I. I'm aware of. Campbells have two humps and they only, they only have one out. They are dr dumb. Drumadary. Drumadary. I've heard that word before. Yes. Long time ago. They are pushing me though. Let's, let's try to show them something. Hey. You can't push us, yo. It's not allowed. Tighter. Go tighter and tighter. Just don't let them. Okay, social media time. Camels are a force to be reckoned with. Hold on, we can't push the camels. You need more people. Prevent the camels from trampling the temps. That would make sense. Let's try to kind of get in the way of that. All right, there we go. Yeah, megaphone is really kind of important. Okay, now they're, they're kind of losing their nerve a little bit. Some of them are.
We have basically surrounded a cow. Oh, that ba that cow backed off after getting literally surrounded by us. That's good. I mean, I guess it's going okay. This is clearly, yeah, this is the mountain muted, but. I think Megaphone also just kind of gets them to automatically go where it's most effective for them to be defending. Which is very handy. What's weird is that we're getting technically pushed back, yet our bar is still okay? Like, it, I don't understand the bar. I really don't. The bar seems to dynamically adjust. And I'm not entirely sure how. I mean, we're technically keeping them away from the tents, so... I guess it's fine. The hell happened a while, I know. But the, this is, remember, these are based, these are separated by chapters. So I figured I'd go through this chapter. We can't, there's not that many missions. I think it's only five missions or so per area. I really feel like we're losing ground, but I don't know. I guess we're fine for now. Keep clustering, don't let them through, don't let them through. Push. Cut. Right. We are slowly losing ground, I feel, but it may not matter. Form the sort of wall that want to push me out of an area. Well, they're kind of just push me around the area. That's fine. Not really pushing me out of it though. Also, I think I won there. They don't want the tents. So they just want to push me out of the area. Well, they can't really push this many people, so it's fine. Please move cautiously. They did. They did move very cautiously. Oh no. Oh no. Okay. You know what? I just realized. Let me. Let me see something. I think I figured something out. Okay. Do, do I have access to this? Okay. I do. Good. Whoops. Hold on a second. So if you hit back on the news thing, it takes you back to the previous mission for some weird reason. But it does count it as completed, so that's fine. So I guess the fact that you're peaceful, you remain more people. You retain more people, okay. Alright, last one, then we'll switch games. Slingshot? <laughs> Look how we have like bombs, some rockets, and now we just have a slingshot. <laughs> okay. I mean, fair enough. It would, that would that'd be annoying. We have a multi plus. Oops. All right, last one. I really like how the game keeps like handing me like have these violent weapons, and I'm like, no. <laughs> uh, what makes a plus? Uh, fiery explosion. It's filled with napalm instead of petrol. Yeah, that would make a difference. Hello, stickers. So this is the last mission, then we'll switch games. I like the peaceful, I like the peaceful option. That is very plus, yeah, a little bit. We can't win with violence, everyone calm down. Yes. This is, oh, this guy is going to get screwed, isn't he? What's going to happen here? Conquer the square, send the cops home. Okay. Just 
Push? No, just push. That's oh well. I'm they push away. The opposite. Well, guess what I'm good at. Guess what I'm. You know why I'm good at pushing, guys? Because I'm a fat doggo. If I decide to casually waltz into somebody, they're getting pushed over. <laughs> this is the push tactic is something that a fat dog knows well. I mean, really, it's all about getting through. So I think I can do this. Up the main floor. There we go. Of course, area up gets firearms. Yes. Yes, we are. Are they killing people? I don't think they are. I think they're just. Are they beanbags again? Beanbag shotguns again? I'm not sure. We have learned at this point the police cannot handle the power of social media. Wait, what, what, oh, is our line, wait, what, I'm sorry? What's our line counts as exactly? It's now, why is our line behind us? I don't under, the one thing I have a problem with this game is it's not very clear of its directions and information. At least I don't feel it is. Are we failing to push somebody? Who are we failing to push? Push the tank. Oh, okay. That sounds a little difficult, but I'll give it a shot. I'm apparently provoking now. I'm not sure I'm doing that, considering I'm really just using the same tactics as always. I guess because I'm pushing? Megaphone's really fuck. Why are we getting pushed so far? Hey, guys, come back. Come back. What the hell happened there? I'm just calling some people on social media. Every so oh, there's police on the other side of us? What? That could explain it. Oh, we're a little, we're a little just scattered at this point. That's not great. Regroup, regroup, regroup. Group, group, group. If I just can keep regrouping, they can't really break my, uh... Can't really break my position too long if I keep regrouping. Social media. I'm actually losing ground when I call social media because I'm not using the megaphone for a little bit. It's probably worth it, though. I gotta say, I'm not sure exactly how to select which group I want. You notice how there's icons in the upper left? It's it's my four groups. Um, so up up on the right analog stick is the top group. Right on the right analog stick is the third group. Left is the second group, and down is the fourth group. I don't understand that really. Also, what am I, I'm having trouble here? You know, push guys, push. Why are my guys losing their nerve in this one? Normally, I have a lot better time moving them. Someone's hurt times one, because they're actually hurting people, probably. I like how they're shooting people, and it says they're passive. Payback? What are you talking payback? I don't understand. I'm not the one shooting people. Am I mean, we're violent? How did I get violent? I'm not sure what happened. I have gone violent, yes. Um, not sure how I did that, because I'm playing the exact same way as I always play. But I apparently have gone violent. I have two violent groups. Do I need to calm them down? Let's try calming them down, I guess. There's a lot of blood on the ground. Oh, I see. I, I see how you calm down. You hold Y for a little bit. I see. I understand now. That's also probably why we were disorganized, because they were violent and not focusing on what I wanted them to do. Anyways, we lost. Oh, God, the tank. 
Oh wait, no, we didn't lose? Wait, who won? Who won? I'm confused. Did I win? I guess I won. Okay. Again, this game kind of confuses me if you can't tell. 60 policemen on the run? What? So over 60 police officers were assaulted, chased down in Egypt in a riot involving 96 people. The bullet caused 7 victims, plus 20 total injured in 60 minutes. After months, 7 innocent activists being killed, people are scared and furious about what happened. The shock seemed to affect many people outside the process as well. People are throwing wheels. Why are people throwing wheels? Okay. I unlocked the Terrier Library. And Klitschy so spoils. Okay. Media. Cause extra media help to document the event. Maltov. Plus. Slingshot. So basically you unlock stuff you can use in other modes. Gla Gavlin will? Glavin Gavlin deal. Oh. Okay. The guy's like, okay, I guess I'll go. <laughs> yeah, I, f I figured out at the end how to change them from modes. They can go violent on their own, but I can actually make them go passive again. But I have to hold down the Y button and not do anything else for a while. So it takes a little effort to make them calm down. What? Why is this so... Eerie. That strangely eerie ending to that. Okay. I'm eating tortellini, learn, or tortellini pasta. I see. Huh. Well, we've already seen the credits, so I will skip that. Well, that was Riot then, eh? This is an interesting game. I... It's definitely a unique game. Like, I don't think I've ever seen a game quite like this. It's very confusing for me. But it's really cool to play through the campaigns and uh, see all this cutscenes, so... Really digging that. And also, the music is definitely kicking. I can honestly see this soundtrack in, like, a first-person shooter or something, too. It's just a really good soundtrack, so... That was Riot. Riot... Uh, Civil Unrest is the subtitle for that, yes. <laughs>